In this video, I'll be covering how to add and close tabs with Selenium in Python. If you don't know what Selenium is, Selenium is a framework for browser testing, but most of the people use the framework for web browser automation related things. All right, so in my script, I'm going to import the web browser's library first. I'm going to type import selenium web driver as web driver. Next, I'm going to construct my browser object, and I'll be using Google Chrome driver for uh, this demonstration. All right, so from web driver dot Chrome, I'm going to provide my driver's path to the executable path parameter. And my driver is located under drivers, com, driver.exe. And I'll name the output as browser. All right, so the reason why I'm using com driver for uh, this exercise is because uh, for some reason why attempt to use a uh, Firefox driver, Firefox driver is going to open a new window instead of a new tab. And I think this issue has related to how the internal driver works. All right, so let's say I want to navigate to a website called Google. Let's navigate to google.com. So here I'll type browser.get, then I'll insert the URL. And let me execute these three lines. Oh, this should be Chrome driver. Right, and try again. And I'll launch the browser and navigate to google.com. All right, so let's say if I want to navigate to a different page. So if I change the uh, website to, let's do YouTube. Instead of creating a new tab, the game method is going to navigate to the URL that is specified on the current tab. And I want to navigate to youtube.com on a different tab. To insert a new tab, we can uh, execute JavaScript. So from browser the execute script. Inside the execute script method, we'll type window dot open. Then we can assign the URL that we want to open. And let's say I want to navigate to uh, Google Maps the, uh, website. And if I run line six, and that's going to open a new tab. But if I type browser.currentURL, if I print the current URL, it's going to print YouTube's uh, web address. That means everything we do right now is going to be on uh, YouTube's website. And I want to change my focus to uh, Google Maps website. So what I need to do here is I need to uh, use the switch to method. And I want to tell the browser that I want to switch my uh, focus to the tab that I just created. So from browser, the window handles. Here, let me take out uh, this statement outside. If I print browser the window handles attribute, it's going to give us all the tab IDs to all the tabs that are currently open on the browser. And I want to set my focus to Google Maps tab. So here, I'll insert one as the reference ID. Then I'll execute line nine. Oh, this should be switched to that window. All right, so if I print browser that current URL, and that's going to change the uh, current tab address to Google Maps. If I want to close YouTube's tab, then I need to use the switch to that windows method. I need to switch the uh, Active tab back to uh, YouTube's website. Then I can use the Close method to close the tab. And if we print the current URL attribute again, it's going to give us uh, this unknown error, what view not found. And to fix that issue, again, we need to set the active window back to uh, Google Maps tab. And because if I run Windows, that Windows handle, 
And there's only one ID available, so we can simply reference the first element and switch the focus back to the first tab. All right, so this is going to be everything I'm going to cover in this video. And hopefully you guys found this video useful. And as always, thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys on the next video.